Hey guys, in this video we are going to be looking at tab groups in uh, your app. So, I uh, remember when you first created your default uh, project and you opened your app.js and you found this like uh, relatively mediocre size or long uh, code and if you actually uh, run your simulator without touching it, it shows this. We have a tab tabbed application yeah we have uh, two windows and inside it we have a view and inside that we have two labels now that we know what the view and window and label is we can actually talk about it so we have two labels window one and window two and we have titles in each and we have two tabs and we have the image of the tab which is like this one and we have this one which is like a ui and a views which is inside your resources by default ks underscore nav underscore ui dot png and the other one so what we're going to do is actually create our own uh tab groups using uh the given two images because there's not much point googling and just like spending five minutes trying to find a nice looking icon so let's delete whatever you were doing in your app.js and what we're going to do is initially create a tab group. So if our tab group equals tie.ui.create tab group. Okay. Now normally we have a window and then we have a view and then we have whatever inside of you. So we could like add buttons to our view and then we add the view to the window. But then because we are going to have multiple windows and we want to uh, control it using a tab we are going to add our windows into our tab groups so that's why we are going to have a variable tab group which creates a tab group at the top so after that we are going to have whoops win one equals tie dot ui dot create window like usual and inside this we are going to say let's change actually add the title first uh window one window where are my window one comma and background color to uh, yellow like usual and don't forget the semicolon now let's just create another very uh, variable win two which is going to have another window create window inside that let's change the title to window two and the background Oops, color to blue like how I always do it and what we're going to do is add uh, a tab so you're going to say we're going to create a tab called tab1 or the variable tab1 say tie.ui.create a tab because the top code all it does is going to create a tab group we need to create a tab and then assign a window to each one so inside that let's say uh, or we could start with the title. Title is tab one, which is going to be displayed uh, at the bottom or when you're clicking the tab. If your iPhone at the top, if you're clicking a tab in your Android, I'll show you later when we use the simulator. And let's change the icon to this one. So KS yes, underscore nav underscore UI. Uh, should I should I use UI or view? Let's choose views. I don't know. I forgot which one was which, but I think for the first tab it was views in the default one, and then the, we need to assign a window to it, which is going to be win one. And there we go. Let's create another tab. Oop, OCD. Uh, di dot ui dot create dot create tab. And inside it, just like the other one, let's add a title tab two icon could is going to be ks underscore nav underscore ui dot png again. It's default one when you create your whole a uh, default uh, project. It's just inside your resources. And window is going to be win two, which we created somewhere over over here. Now what we're going to do is going to add the tab to your tab group because the window is already inside your not inside but assigned to your tab so let's say tab group but not tab not tag tab group dot add tab and inside tab one 
and again tab uh, group dot add tab and tab two because that's the name of our variables and instead of opening windows we are going to open the tab group so tab group dot open oops like so and let's save our work and run it in our simulator hopefully it's going to work with no stupid uh, typos because I tend to do that loads of times yep it's loading the simulator it's launching the application and there we go we have our iPhone and wait for it wait for it it's spinning the wheel is it the wheel or is it a plate oh. the application started and we have two windows or two uh, tabbed windows so we have win1 which has a background color of yellow and we have a win2 which has a background color of blue now if you look at a code if you go to win1 it has a title window 1 which is being displayed over here and if you go to win2 it has a title win window 2 which is being displayed over here now when we created our tab using create tab in our tab 1 the title is being displayed over here tab 1 and tab 2 and yeah I guessed right that nice looking icon is actually the uh, ks underscore nav dot ui and the views image which comes by default and we are signed of the windows so that when we click on it that window displays and yeah that's it uh, there's actually one more thing we could do with tabs what we could actually like do a bit of controlling with them like add badges and stuff so what we could do is say uh, tab group dot tabs and because uh, the tabs are being stored as an array uh, the first tab tab 1 is going to be tabs not O zero okay and what we could do is I don't know like set badge uh, and we could add like three badges to it Oh, you'll see what badges are when I run the simulator because it's actually like a notification number thing being popped on the top right or wherever. We could do is, I don't know, like tab. Actually, this is enough, I think. Uh, let's run the iPhone simulator. There's loads of other things like tab group dot tabs and then dot like title and then we could use the ti.api.info to display over here and so on for like loads of debugging testing purposes and dot said badge is useful when you want like uh, notifications in your app and there we go we have in our first tab which is tab zero we set the badge to three so now we have uh, the number three on our tab that looks familiar doesn't it so yeah, that's a uh, uh, quick, not short, relatively okay, it's under 10 minutes, so it's a relatively short video on uh, tabs and, and tab groups in Titanium.